Worthen FC TV with Adam Hinchwood looking ahead to Slough away in the National League South. Adam, how are you feeling going into this one? Oh yeah, it'd be, be a tough game. I've obviously uh, been there already this year in the FA Cup. Um, it was a uh, real tough game. They compressed us really well and you know, we had to be patient on that day. So uh, I'm pretty sure it would be a similar sort of encounter. Um, I think we would have learned a lot more about ourselves from that um, that game in terms of you know how we play and personnel and everything. So yeah, we obviously like to carry on a bit of a run that we're on. Um, so um, and they they picked up some good results as well. So you know in, in these games there's not much in them and you know need a little bit of luck on the day and the old goal seems to settle these ones. So you know we know we're going to have to be at our best to get anything from it. Yeah, it's been difficult for them recently. They've been a little bit out of form while we've been picking up. But those two games we played them previously, they seem like quite tough customers. You expect it to be quite a difficult team to break down? No, yeah, same, same again. A lot of experience. Um, Scott's brought in some experience um, up top and and throughout the team. So um, yeah, they're obviously be playing with points proof. Scott's got a lot of quality from set pieces and. He's demonstrated that a few times already in recent weeks. So, yeah, it's going to be a big, big, tough game. Um, but, yeah, we, we would like to focus on ourselves. I think, like, we're a young group, but we're, we're learning a lot as we go in, you know. Um, even the goal the other day, um, we'll do some work on what we can do better on that one. Um, the goal previously, where JB was marking in the box, I thought on Tuesday night he was marking brilliantly. So, you know, that's all, all we're doing. We're, we're learning, um, and that's all you can ask from the players. And... You want us now to sort of put that all together um, on, on Saturday. And speaking of uh, learning lessons, Mo Dabra obviously got that red card on, on Tuesday, the second yellow. So he is missing. Who do you think might come in to replace him? Um, I think he's available this week. Uh, I think it kicks in seven days, so he'll be missing for Epsley. So, um, yes, um, we've got a few options um, in that position. Obviously, you can move Josh a slightly more advanced role. Um, Rather than he was playing a bit deeper the other night, so um, also you know we've got Danny Barker, who him and Lewis, you know Saturday, Tuesday is you know we just got to be careful, want them back for the rest of the season, and didn't want to rush them. Um, Kane's missing this weekend, so I think it was important to if we was missing both of them to go to go into Slough would have been a real real sort of tough ask. So um, yeah, we just wanted to rest Danny a bit, and you know he'll obviously be available. We've got Finn Chadwick with our 18s that can play in that deeper position. Um, player that we really like. Um, obviously got um, Callum Chesworth who's just come back in, who's a centre midfield player. Um, another one that we really like, a bit more of an advanced midfielder, likes to score goals. So you know, we've got some exciting players um, that we might be able to have a look at as well. Um, Ruben's back from his bout of tonsillitis and you know, he's going to get some minutes with Finn today in the under 18 game. So they should be available for us. So, yeah, some good, exciting uh, players to call upon. Um, but, you know, the whole squad's going to be needed. It's Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday again next week. Um, two of them away again. Um, so it's a real, real tough ask. So, you know, all the players are going to be needed. Yeah, in the midst of a, a long run of games away from home with Chippenham included, it's, it's free on, free on the trot away. How much of a grind is that for the players with the, the longer journeys? That is, yeah, it's, it's a tough ask, uh, Murley leaves and, and stuff like that, but, you know, seven of the fans, you know, unbelievable turnout away at Chippenham, just disappointed um, with how the game panned out for them, um, you know, making making that journey on a Tuesday night, giving up all their time and effort to, uh, and money to come and support the lads, we, we see them at the service station on the way back and, you know, it's... Um, it does give us a lift and it really is appreciated, um, you know, just the, the amount of support that we get. Um, so I'm sure they'll be there in abundance again in the next two games. So it's a, it's a tough ask for, for, for everyone at the moment. Um, but, you know, we want to try and repay their, their faith and their support with a real good, good honest performance.